History came to life during Delphi's annual Wabash and Erie Canal Days. Th that was this weekend, and News 18 Samantha Tiki reports the event gives a glimpse of traditions of the past. It gets kids and everyone outdoors, and they get to hear the music and keeps kids from playing games all day in the house. Delphi resident John Titus says the Wabash and Erie Canal Days Festival has become a family tradition. But he says the festival showcasing what life was like in mid 19th century Delphi is also an educational experience. They get to see what used to be and how easy it is today versus what they see here now. Carpenter Rob Lawson knows a little something about teaching traditions of the past. He uses the festival to carry on his family's legacy of handmade carpentry. Everything was made by hand and it gives them the experience of that that age. Lawson uses his skills to teach others how to build things by hand, letting children hammer nails to create their very own birdhouse. He says it's experiences like this that help keep history alive. It'll get lost if they if they don't get if they don't get the experience, they don't see what the past was. Just reading it in a book won't give them the experience. And whether it's blacksmithing, paper making, or learning about the history of Delphi during a boat ride down the canal. Titus's wife, Rebecca Titus, says it's not just learning about what life was once like that keeps their family coming back each year. It's just good family time, honestly, just to come down, walk around, look at all the different things. Quality time. Reporting in Delphi, Samantha Tiki, News 18.